be immigrants from Ghana, West Africa. We having the American dream of owning our own business. After we moved from Houston, where we had a lot of African and Caribbean markets over there. When we relocated here in 1993, we didn't see any of the markets here. So we started the store in 1999 to have authentic African Caribbean food products to serve the needs of the customers here. A lot of people outside of the African Caribbean community don't know about it, but folks that are, they like, yeah, and they come from far distances actually to be here. They have almost everything we have in my country. This is the only place you can find all this food. Almost every African come here to shop because of the spices, the ingredients. We come from San Marcos to get these types of products because you don't sell them just anywhere. So I think this market has a great potential to serve beyond its current audience and really expand to meet new people. We wanted to grow from a basic product that we sell here to a more healthy food. The main goal is to improve healthy food access, improve and promote healthy food access and even if we help a market get better quality food on the inside and we change the appearance on the inside of the market, it still really needs to look beautiful on the outside as well. What we decided to do is have a facelift at the store so that we can attract more customers and have an environment that they will feel at home. We kind of see this as a bigger community engagement project to help really beautify this section of El Cajon Boulevard and really make this a nice block and area of City Heights where people can feel safe to shop and to walk and just socialize with each other. When I saw it, I was very happy. I said, oh, this is some renovation. That means our help is, you know, also going a long way.